Wanna slice, got the roll of dice, that's why All my life, I've been grinding all my life bro. All my life, been grinding all my life Sacrifice, hustle, pay the price Wanna slice, got the roll of dice, that's why All my life, I've been grinding all my life bro. Baby, so How do you think we're so compatible in our relationship? <laughs> um... Or why do you think? Just as a, just as, just without that, you know? Alright, without that, I mean, you know, like I said, baby, you know, she low-key got me on. I'ma let it be known. Like Chris Brown would say, you know, this my baby, she opened my third eye. Nah, I'm just <laughs> That's my baby, she will. Nah, but, um, yeah, so, shout out Chris Brown and the go anyway. Um, I just feel we so compatible because we- Compatible. Come back. <laughs> Come back. Compatible. <laughs> Let me fix that for y'all. <laughs> you know, I just had uh, uh, something in my throat. Uh, uh. Nah, <laughs> but uh, I just, you know, feel we're so compatible because uh, we're just both like loving, caring person. I mean, god damn, <laughs> I can't talk right now. Am I still sleepy? The fuck yeah, you know? we're still sleepy. We woke but up. we're loving and caring people. You feel me? Like, you know, I'm a Pisces, so you know, empathy is like big for me, you know. She a tourist, so empathy big for her. Like, that's why we get along because we always look at, you know, the bigger picture. We always see pretty much what other people don't see. We just do what we gotta do. Yeah, that's what draws us together, for sure, for sure. So, yeah, because I feel like people who are, like, say, for instance, like, someone's an Aquarius, right? Like, that's mm -hmm. their star sign, like, their birthday. Their birthday. <laughs> Okay, part <laughs> behind me, because what the, we've been sitting here for like ten minutes. Man, so, okay, like five damn. minutes. Okay, three minutes. Like goddamn. But oh, because I'm in the fucking crosswalk. That's why. Oh, but a car is behind me. But anyways, I feel like if someone's like an Aquarius, like their birthday is like what January or February, mm -hmm. and they're like, oh, okay, I'm gonna talk to a Gemini. But that mm -hmm. Gemini is like what May or June. Mm -hmm. So like, say like, okay, that person's Aquarius, that person's a Gemini. Mm -hmm. So they might feel like they're already like compatible, but that might not be true because what if that, um, what if that Aquarius has like, um, let's just say they have like Pisces and Scorpio. And right. like their moon and ascendant sign. And then right. that Gemini is like a Gemini, Gemini, Leo. Like, let's just say. So those other two signs aren't like compatible with that person. Mm -hmm. So for our instance, oh, but before we get into us, right. RP Nipsey. Nipsey hey, is a Leo, Leo, Pisces. And hey. Lauren, they didn't put Lauren London's um, rising, but she, her moon is a, um, she's a Taurus moon, um. and but she's a Sagittarius. So Leos and Sagittarius are already supposedly like soulmates, right. allegedly. And then and of course Pisces, and Pisces. Right, and that's course. us. <laughs> so no. it's like, you know what I mean? So like they were like, right. like, man, like, I can just imagine like the pain that she went through when she's like, you know, at the funeral, just like knowing like, like, cause you know, I feel like it hits you at the funeral. Yeah, you know, because it's like when someone dies, like you don't really like unless you see their body, like physically, like when they just shut down, like literally you watch them die. I feel like it hits you harder, like at the funeral I mean, with everybody. You know. I mean, I feel like for me, it really hit her when, yeah, when she seen that body, like she actually heard he was dead in the hospital because mm -hmm. he was pronounced dead. So somebody, you know how man, you know how you got people out here. You feel me? They just happen to be the right place, right time. Right. So Lauren London walked right in. They Dignity Health Hospital. God damn, what's wrong with this? But anyway, <laughs> Dignity Health Hospital. You feel me? Lauren right. Lennon, right? Somebody was recording, and yeah, you just see like the emotion, like you know, running through her right there. Like, but what you doing? This my husband. Blah, blah, blah. Like, goddamn, like that shit made me feel so. Good. I'm like, damn, like my nigga really gone. Like, oh me, if Lauren Lennon really tripping like that, my nigga is really gone. Like, I don't right. want to believe it. Like, I wasn't even trying to believe it when. When CNN put that shit up, but when I saw it on like Google, like basically, yeah, the rapper deceased on on March 31st. But like, what? Like, that's not real, bro. That cannot be real, money. Yeah. Like that? Nah, that's not correct for you, bro. It is. Why you gonna fall? You know, you gonna stop and shit. Watch me. All right, I, hey, if anybody could do it. Well, I, I was know. doing it yesterday, but I mean, it did kind of fall. But I mean, but okay. So, anyways. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh, so for me and my baby, it's cool, it's cool. So for me and my babe, you know, so he has a moon in Taurus and my moon is in Virgo. So Virgo and Tauruses are already like compatible. And then his rising is in Capricorn and mine is in 
uh, Cancer, they're already like compatible. And then obviously Taurus and Pisces. Obviously. So, right. And so it's interesting too, because in each and every one of our like natal, what is it, natal birth chart, yeah. we're basically compatible in each of the like, each, each of our zodiacs are compatible in the planets. So like Venus, like our both of our Venuses are in Aries. My, and that shit is deep as fuck because it's like <laughs> damn like Aries like are so like they could be very stubborn as well you know and like we both have Taurus in us so like we're just stubborn and he's a Capricorn and I have Capricorn in me too so it's like damn so it's just like interesting My, just like we're just we, we get have, along so it's like damn like, we, we're never gonna like we the same thing we're, so yeah like, we're literally like he I feel like honestly you're my twin flame like we're literally a reflection of each other like just so, what is that again? You said so a twin right? flame it's opposite Honestly, like I'm still learning about this shit too. I'm not gonna lie, so I'm not like an expert. But all I can say is that, like, I feel like he's my twin flame because they say it's like a reflection, and like when you guys get into it, you get into it. But it's because you love each other, you want what's best for each other. Right. And I feel like when you're with um, like a soulmate, it could just be like you guys known each other in like a past life. But I feel like a twin flame, like you guys are meant to be together in this life. Like a soulmate, you're. That's why they say like you're not always meant to be with your soulmate. Right. If that makes sense, like it could be your soulmate, like. You know, a person could be dead, but you feel like that was your soulmate. Yeah. And that's how I feel like with my girl, you know, like I feel like that's her situation with like our friend Danielle that passed away. Like that was her soulmate because she has to live every day knowing that that person is gone. And it's like she feels a part of her is like missing. So like I feel like you're my twin flame because at the end of the day, like we're supposed to be together. And the reason, like, everything that we go through, like, we feel, like, it's always, like, okay, like, I feel, like, when you're with someone, like, you feel like that's, like, like I said, a reflection, like, you feel like you're supposed to be with that person. I mean, that makes sense totally because I would say, yeah, like, I feel like our, as far as our, uh, you know, baby had me in the camera, you know what I'm saying, we both looking good, <laughs> but, uh, you know, blue shades, but anyway, um, like I said, you feel me? I, I could believe that because, I mean, now that she broke it down to me, I'll say, yeah. Because, I mean, you know, I'm not saying we just argue, but, I mean, who's perfect? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, perfect. But it's like, when we argue, it's like, you know, not a lot of people could just bounce back and, and really Exactly. Just, and it's yeah. like, we argue, like, our arguments just come from, like, us trying to be, like, we're just learning each other and we're trying to grow and, like, right. be better. Right. So it's like, obviously, like, when I get into it, like, last night, I'm not going to tell them what our argument was. Well, no, yeah. We, we know, you know what I'm talking that. about. You but, I mean, never but tell it, I outside they, people your inside shit. Yeah, because they saying. don't need to know that shit. Right. This is our relationship. They're not in our relationship. Exactly. So I just feel like, honestly, like, it's just to better myself. Right. Because I told you, like, I, you know, well, I'm not going to, you know, put our business out there, right. but you know what I'm trying to say, babe. Right. Like, and people, like, <laughs> the day you know your argument should be based on trying to better each other like how can yeah. i help you like you see what my issue is and i'm explaining it to you so that you can understand like i'm telling you how i feel and what i'm right. used to so it's like you know you can't get like so mad like i understand his anger or you know your couple or your spouse or whoever your boyfriend girlfriend right. their anger it has to be from a good place if they're like low-key like accusing you of shit like shit could be toxic in relationships right. like, i say our relationship isn't toxic it's just like when people everyone argues it don't matter who it is mom and dad like you're gonna get an argument that's normal like right. that, if you don't get an argument that's unhealthy right that's like, like healthy as fuck yeah that's just weird because it's like damn like it's like a person like you with your boy all day and y'all ain't never gotten to it like, ever what that's, that's not why, your like, boy I have friends that like honestly each and every one of my friends even the ones that like you, like literally they couldn't even make you mad Someone's gonna make you mad sometimes, like, or make you feel some type of way. Yeah, and that's okay. Like, it's okay to, you know, agree yeah. to disagree. Yeah, that's definitely. totally fine. Definitely, it is. But like I said, I just feel like, yeah, if you just all day in in, in, in somebody face that you fuck with like that, you feel me? And y'all don't have no like no debates, no art like you feel like. Me? Where's the love? Right. Like, you have to at least if you open up to someone, I feel like you're showing that you really love that person. You have to because at the end of the day, it's like you know everybody have feelings, and if you don't like you know show them feelings, then it's like because you don't really care. You exactly. Know what I mean? So it's like yeah, okay. Why do I have to show you my feelings? I don't give a fuck. Right. I don't give a fuck what you do. I don't give a fuck about nothing. Right. You feel me? But I feel like yeah, if you really actually you know because it's. it's it's not easy, especially living in this world uh, today. You know, society like they make everything weak. Like you feel me? Especially if you show your feelings. Like you feel me? This is not a fucking eighties R and B group <laughs> where niggas is all the time fucking. Oh 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 oh. oh. <laughs> hey, 
love you. Love you. You feel me? This is not computer love. You feel me? Niggas can't niggas can't really do that no more. Like on me, you gotta like have a hard shell. You have to. But I feel like with that, like certain people, on me, if you could do that, then on me, like you fuck with them for sure. And like, I mean, that's just what we saying. Cause I know for sure, like she get, she say I'm. I get on her last nerve, but it's just because I can't hide feelings from her. Like, I can't. I try. I'm not going to lie, but it just don't work. Okay, and so that's the other thing that I meant to say is that, you know, I feel like if you're, you know you're supposed to be with somebody, like, if you can feel when something's wrong. Like, if, if someone be like, oh, nothing's wrong, or like, no. Like, there's a tone in their voice. There's a body language. But even, like, that's just basic human nature. Like, we know well, yeah, when something's up, like, yeah, based yeah. off of energy and vibes. But at the end of the but day, it's like, for you to care. Right, exactly. That's it. Look. the... Because <laughs> I got mm -hmm. lipstick on. <laughs> I know. I know. We normally kiss on the lip for that way. <laughs> but you know, baby looking good. You know what I'm saying? Hey, man, I, I ain't trying to mess with the lipstick. You know, baby took time. I don't know why I put the lip gloss on. We about to eat uh, some wings. That shit finna get all of them. I gotta just wipe this whole, I just gotta wipe the whole lipstick off. Like, but um, yeah. So I just felt like, babe, honestly, like, yeah, if people don't care, like, then you're not supposed to be with that person. Like, I legit care. Like, I can't go to sleep. And they say, like, the fucking Bible says that. Like, not to lay your head down at night at rest, knowing that you're, like, basically quarreling, like, with somebody, like, beefing, like, in an argument. Like, you never supposed to end the night like that, no matter who it is. I can't, because I remember what's on me, like, baby was really on my head, and I was like, man, like, I'm not gonna lie, like, I already told y'all, you feel me, I'm probably so, you know, we be in our feelings and shit, but, so she was really on my head, like, you know, like, really, so I'm like, hold on, like, wait, I can't, no, mm -mm, I'm gonna talk to you later. And like how I feel at the moment, of course, I'm like, oh yeah, I'm not gonna hit her, like, you know, but I'm the type of nigga, like I said, you know, pride is nothing to let down to me. You feel me? Like, I don't see how people just let pride, like, I mean, pride will really get you killed. You feel me? Like, it that really will. So it's like, it's nothing for me to be a bigger person, you know, and shit like that. Just like, just like it is for her, I feel. See, that's another thing that, that draws together because to me, it's like, for you to be able to do that, like, you strong as fuck because that's not easy. For like, what? Like, far as letting pride down. You right. feel me? Like, far as if you like, got a big ego, do not be with no one that is right. willing to let their shit down for you. Right. Like, y'all have to both willingly come man. together and really, like, get past that shit. Right. Really got to compromise. Because that deadass will leave a situation. I don't give a fuck. Like, right. because of what I've been through. And we are obligated to our own feelings and our own, like, you know... Like, and see, that could be that tourist shit. Because right. that tourist shit, like, we get back into our, like, self. Or we just, like, we'll shut down, too. Like, and Pisces does that, too. Right. Because it's like, we don't put up with no bullshit. Like, right. period. That's what I'm saying. See, it's like, it's another thing. Okay, I let my, that's what I was going to say. Like, I let my pride down. But, okay, back to the thing before I get down. You know, hey, me and baby could talk all day. I'm telling you. <laughs> but anyway, uh, right. damn, what well, I said. Oh, so, yeah, baby was really on my head. And like she would just, you know, just to piggyback off what she was talking about, like on me, I just really couldn't go to sleep without me really knowing, like, like you feel me, like me and baby was like, I mean, we wasn't not good, but you feel me, I couldn't go to sleep without, like, cause the way I felt, it's like, hold on, like, hold on, like, I had to hit her, like, on me, like, you know, I let like probably two, three hours go, but hold on, no, I, I need to talk to baby now, like, on me, like, you good, you feel me, fuck all that other shit, that's all bullshit, you feel me? Like we say that's just feeling but that's that to me that's also letting pride down because i know other niggas you feel me if if they was to you know go through you know what we go through and shit like that they would fucking be like nah i'm not mm -mm, nope fuck that bitch nope right fuck that period. nigga fuck like that. Fuck that nigga. right but that's weak shit to me because if you can't really like talk shit out Right. And really come to like it out and come to an agreement. Y'all right. can both agree to disagree. Exactly. So it's like you feel me? Like that's what we talking about right there. Like I mean, I really can't go to like I really don't be going to sleep like unless like we cool. Like if we get here, then on me, I gotta hit her right back. Like oh, you me, good? Me. You solid? <laughs> I have to get something like that. Right. <laughs> My fish ass. <laughs> nah. Oh, we're gonna go swimming in that ocean today oh, yeah, after man. our videos, though, because you know I'm gonna look kind of crazy. <laughs> you know, <laughs> I'm gonna go crazy with the ocean waves on my way. Hey, ocean view. <laughs> 
you know, I always gotta shout that out, man. That's my favorite song, my nigga. So, yeah. But yeah, to wrap this video up, though, that's how we're compatible. We're gonna put our, we're gonna compare our birth charts together, so you guys can see, what? like, you know, our relationship and how that, like, because people feel that they could just date, like, oh. I'm a Pisces. I'm a date a Taurus or a Scorpio. Right. What if that Taurus, what if that Pisces is literally like a Pisces? Right. Right? <laughs> so yeah, man, you see, hey, that's that football. You know what I'm saying? That's that football in me. I caught that motherfucking fast. But anyway, <laughs> so <funny>. yeah. <laughs> but no, um. Yeah, that's pretty much it, babe. What else do you have to say to wrap it up? Um, all right, to wrap it up, like babe said, you know, y'all gonna see our bird turn and shit. But just to piggyback what she was saying, it's just crazy to me because on me it's like i was just really attracted because i mean i don't really like aquarius i'm not even gonna lie to you only because i just feel like they lie too much they always fucking just try to make they self like look good you know like they got Never. pride like they really yeah, and they i hate pride. that shit like because they're, very, like, they're air signs so they're very airheaded like right, they right. don't they're not like down to earth right like, you're so a water like, sign and i'm an earth sign so it's like at the end of the day we connect on an earth like a we connect on a grounded way right. but we can still go out like exactly. you know what i'm saying because i have trail, cancer right. in me too and virgo right. so like i can still be out but like that taurus in me is grounded but see i feel like that's what he needs in a relationship and that's what i need too i don't need someone that's just like like you feel me you can't have someone that's exactly the same like of course you're gonna right. have like different elements like his right. element you're basically an earth and water babe because you're a Pisces, Pisces is water, Capricorn right. and Taurus are earth. Right. Um, Virgo and I have two herbs. See, that's why we really Virgo connect because we cancer. both have two exactly. Right. Cancer is a water sign, just like Pisces. Oh, okay, cancer is water. Okay. So cancer is a water sign. Right. And so it's Taurus and Virgo. Taurus and Virgo is my earth. Yeah. Your earth is Taurus and Capricorn. Right. So it's deep as fuck. Like we right. both have two earth signs and one water sign. So we're both like that's why we're so fucking compatible. Mm -hmm. Because when you think about it, it's like okay, we balance each other out. Like we both have the same shit. So it yes. equals out. Like you see what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying, balances out. Like you have this, like you could have three, I have three. Right. Like you feel me, we have two two, which is two earth signs, and we both have one water sign in us. That's why we're compatible. See, we balance each other out. Exactly. That's why people say yin yang, you know, find your opposite, find your reflection. I feel like this is really my twin flame because we literally balance each other out in our sign. I mean, I feel like that too, cause I ain't gonna lie. Like I said, I never like really thought of myself going with a torch. Like on me, I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, but like I said, just being with Bay, like on me, she opening like my third eye on me. Like she got me thinking like other shit. Because like I be wondering like, like you feel me? Like I'm a pilot. Like I said, I said that all day. You feel good? That's like my what you say, son? Your son. My sun sign. Your like star that. Sign. Based my personality, so. I, I mean, yeah, you know, you're outward I know a lot of other Pisces, you feel me, because we just, you know, but they weird. I'm not gonna lie. Like, some of the niggas I know that's probably, I'm like, damn, my nigga, you're not no Pisces, bro, on me. Like, you're not. But it makes sense now because, like, what baby put me on is like, okay, yeah, my nigga, you got some, uh, you got some Gemini in you or some, yeah. uh, you got some. I know Pisces, like, my ex, he's a Pisces, but he has Gemini in him. And I always wonder why shit just didn't work out. Right, that's what I'm saying. See that? See, that's because deep. see, and then like you could fuck with like a Taurus, but like say she has your minor or like Aquarius, right. you're not really gonna like. Hell no, I'm not like gonna her click, like right. that. Like gonna it's gonna be you. cool times. Cause I feel like, see, with us, I feel like even the bad times are still cool times. Like right. they're not like, oh my god, this is bad. Like, and I feel like people stay in toxic relationships because it's like. This is so bad, you know? Right, like, and they're okay, afraid of really, them. right. And yeah, they're afraid got, of really being alone. Like, bro. okay, yeah. Because it's, it's like, okay, at the end of the day, there's someone for everybody. Right. Look, 444. <laughs> right. Oh, damn. Hey, hold on. I got to show y'all this real fast. Right, hey, don't think the taxi, don't. Uh, he going to think we're getting him off. Oh, fuck. You know, we're looking. Okay, boom. All right, so yeah, you know, I had to get y'all, man. Y'all saw the four, 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 the four, four, and the four, fours. <laughs> nah, but yeah, man. So, uh, yeah, yeah, just be with someone that you're literally compatible with in each and every element. Like, there That's might it. be one thing that you might disagree on, but at least in the three, at least in the sun, moon, and rising, at least be like, you know, somewhat compatible with that. Right. Because people will get me a Scorpio and get with a Gemini, but that Gemini might be a fucking cancer mm. um pisces and the scorpio is gonna get along with it because the scorpio is all water signs like the scorpio is gonna get along with the cancer and pisces in right. that gemini right. that gemini just might be a gemini 
they didn't choose to be fucking born without June or May. Like, you feel me? Like, they didn't choose that. But it's like, if those other two signs are compatible with the Scorpio, they actually might work out. Like, you see what I'm saying? Right. Period. Well, yeah, you know, we don't want this video to be too long. Right, we gotta we go eat. Exactly. So, <laughs> hey, man, make sure you tune in. You feel like, me? comment, oh. subscribe. To like, comment, channel. subscribe to our channel. Let us you know, know in the comment change. box what y'all want to see or exactly. hear from us. Because, you know, we're going to be talking. All right. Or right, if y'all got any, uh, you know, <laughs> questions about, you know, strategy and all that, we're going to come at y'all. You know, relationships. With anything. Right. But, um, hold on. I'm going to show y'all Ring Inferno right now. Shout out to them. You know what I'm saying? Wait, I'm so excited, babe. So, yeah, man. Uh... <laughs> Make sure, tune in, like, subscribe, all the things.